In this video, we will be exploring more advanced features of menu building. Modifier groups are a way that a menu category or item can be linked to multiple force modifiers. Once the modifiers have been created, you can create a modifier group. Give the group a name and click on Add List to begin adding modifier lists to your groups. You can add as many lists as you want to a single group. Attach the modifier group to your category or item the exact same way you would any other modifier. Modifier groups will always be listed at the bottom. Pizza Creator can be used to create menu items for pizza restaurants. The main purpose of using this feature is to have options like left half, right half, light, and extra built into the modifiers. With your modifiers for pizzas created, click on Pizza Settings. You may need to enable the feature. To make a new creator, click on Edit Creators. Click Add New and provide a name for the pizza creator. Once you click Save, the creator will be added to the list. Click on your new creator to start adding your force modifiers to this group. This is essentially the same process as creating a force modifier group. The one additional setting to pay attention to is the partial serving price. This can affect how toppings on only half of a pizza are handled. With the pizza creator finished, attach through the force modifiers dropdown just like you would any other modifier. Combos are a bit tricky to get the hang of. Very basically, they allow you to combine multiple menu items into a single item. Here I am making a combo for a burger, side, and drink. In the POS, the server or cashier will be guided through each selection. Note that items that have modifiers attached to them will be available when they are used in combos. 